Hey, if I make this putt, Pat, you gotta put me on the show. Oh! <laughs> I was so close to me. I was a little hungry, and I got a dog at the turn. Oh yeah. Um, so yeah, I mean, three putts, that's what kills you. Let's take a trip with Stevie, baby. You know what I'm saying? Your turn. Uh, we are on the east course, Royal Vista. Now he says east. <laughs> yeah, I, I look at the sign right there. East course, Royal Vista, hole number four, par four, uh, 352. So a little shorter par four, but it's a dog leg right. It's not a driver hole. Um, so we're going with a handy dandy two iron. Uh -oh. We're gonna see if we get some nice little rollout, nice and low. Uh, give us a nice little, you know, 120 shot in. So here we go. All right, first question. Talk to me. Get to know Stevie Beeb. Talk to me. Steven Acosta, tell us where your IG name originated from. Good <laughs> question. IG handle was thought up, actually here at this course, Royal Vista, right past the, the snack bar. I was a little hungry and I got a dog at the turn and the rest is history. Like this course, RIP. Yeah, could be the last time here seems like Royal Vista has a lot of memories. It does. Look at this. First, first ever, uh, yeah. first ever barbells and bogeys tournament. Oh, well, that's true. Huh? Yep. Oh yeah. It's out there. Didn't quite get all of it, but I don't need all of it. I got just lay up. Middle of the fairway. We're on top. We'll probably have about 140 in. We'll take that. Two iron for the win. All right, Stevie Icebreaker. I asked this to Juancho one time. He had hey, where a, are my wedges at? Maybe he remembers, maybe he doesn't, but um. You got my wedges in there? No. no? I don't. You, you know left them? Maybe by the green, brother? You never came to back me. There? Uh, let's go back. Oh, all right, uncut. All right, let's see. Oh, no. Uncut. Stevie lost his wedges. <laughs> Stevie let's lost see. his wedges. Let's take a peek. Let's take a gander. Are oh, you ready? Yeah, yeah. Make this. Would you one. rather icebreaker? Uh -huh. Would you rather fart every time, continuously, okay. continuously fart as you're having sex every single time, okay. or would you rather climax? Anytime or anyone says the word pancake. Okay, and the first answer was uh, so every time I'm having sex. Every time you're having sex, you're just you're just, you're letting them go. You're farting nonstop. nonstop, nonstop. There's nothing you can do about it. Um, and it's just you know let's let's say it with every stroke, right? Oh shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, we almost died! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Uncut, uncut. Sorry. <laughs> I was so close to me. Holy fuck! Don't leave your clubs behind. <laughs> we almost died. Oh, Don't man. leave your clubs behind. Um, okay, so I'm gonna have to say every time somebody says pancake. Oh, please. that's the right answer. It's because it's the yeah. only answer. Yeah. The thing is, though, is your boys could figure it out, right? <laughs> and then you're just like, we could be middle Watch of your backswing. Fo football game? Middle of your backswing. I could just Pancake. be like, Pancake. Pancake. <laughs> you know? Um, I mean, could be the worst things that happen to you. That's true, but I mean, farting every time during sex, that's like. That's just, that might kill the mood. It does. It, might kill the vibe. it has to, right? Yeah. But, but the thing is, too, it could be a superpower, right? Because it's like. <laughs> superpower. Yeah, it's like, I'm just going forever until, you know. Well, we might have Pancake. to put a. Uh, a uh, 13 yeah. on this, <laughs> this one. All right, what, what you got for me? Um, let me see. Let me pull up your phone real quick. Yeah. I got questions in here. My passcode for everybody who wants to know it's. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can put it in. That's what it's uncut. It's uncut. <laughs> there you go. I don't think that's you, dog. That's You're not to me. the left. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, quick questions. All right, I'm going to rattle it off here. Okay, go. Um, who is the one person who knows you the best? <laughs> <laughs> On barbells and bogeys. Okay. Ooh. The best? I feel like. This might start some fights. Ooh, that's a tough one. Because I've known Jake the longest. Mm -hmm. 
because we've been, you know, we're, our dads went to high school together. But I ride, I spend more time in the cart with you. Oof. So I'm gonna have to I won't be offended. I'm gonna have to say Team LA. I think I think Javi probably knows me better. Wow. 175. All right, what's the next? You said rapid fire. I'm ready. Rapid fire. Oh man, it locked again. Two, three, two, three. Two, three. How far do you got? 173, I think. What is your favorite number? 33. Where do you see yourself in five years? On a golf course. <laughs> what is your favorite season and why? Summer, because it's summer. Because that's the only answer. Yeah. Um, what, which year was your favorite birthday? Um, oh, that's a good one. Uh, hold on, I'm trying to do this math. I'll go seven. I'm gonna go seven iron. Uh, nice. Your favorite birthday, man. That's mm -hmm. a tough one. Mm, let's see. Probably. I'm. I have like early onset dementia, so I can't really remember a lot of my birthdays. But I feel like there was one I went somewhere. Let me think about that one. As I hit this. That looks good. You know, right, it's gonna roll up that hillside left. It's gonna look really good. Mark my words. All right, best birthday. I feel like I did something cool, sort of recently. I just can't tell you what it was. Um, I know, I will say this. As a kid, we used to have the coolest birthday parties. Shout out mom and dad. We'd have like the characters come over back when you would like hire people. We'd have like Batman came over, and like Spider-Man came over, Power Rangers came over different years, and geez, that looks, that looks good, yeah. Woo. I told you, I used that slope, I've played here before. I've played here before. Um, and one of the years, we had Batman come in, and we had like an alley at this house, and he would like pull up in the alley, jumped up on the fence, and I was probably, I don't know, five, six years old, and I'm crying because <laughs> you see Batman on the fence, he looks scary as fuck. <laughs> so, you know, if you have a five or six year old, maybe don't get Batman to come to your party. <laughs> uh, so yeah, um, I think that's a funny story, so I had to share it with you guys. Uh, most embarrassing moment of your life? Ooh, most embarrassing moment of my life. Uh, I think every time I uh, chunk or blade a wedge <laughs> from 20 feet out. <laughs> if you had to choose one, if you could hit the ball on the fairway every single time, but the ball is only going 250, okay. but it's in the fairway every single time, okay. or to never three putt again, what would you choose? Never three putt again. Never three putt again. Eliminate the three putts. Is there a reason why? Yeah, because... I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. Self-explanatory. You're a golfer. But 250, it's not like it's... If you were to say like 300 every time, maybe. Because then you have a be, like a better chance to hit a green, right? And then yeah. so then closer to the pin, you're probably not going to have as many three putts. In theory. In theory, but it still does happen. Um, so yeah, I mean, three putts. That's what kills you. Three putts kill you. Okay, trivia question. Okay. You're a baseball guy. We're both baseball guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First so, of all, yeah, how champs. do you feel about Shohei Otani? How do I feel Shohei about Shohei Otani is a Dodger. I am excited to see what he does in Dodger Blue. I feel like for the last four years now, the Dodgers have had the best team on paper, and they end up winning 100 games, but they just, that's it. They get bounced in the playoffs. They lose in the World Series. 2020, they were able to pull it off, which some people say is a Mickey Mouse one. I don't agree with that. I think if anything, in some aspects, it's harder to win in a bubble. Um, but yeah, I mean, they just gotta execute now. So with him coming over, I feel like there's more pressure than ever. Uh, but the dude's a stud. I'm excited to see him pitch. I know we gotta wait another year, but um, yeah, it's showtime, baby. That's showtime. right, dog. All right, uh, what year did the Dodgers come to L.A.? Uh, 1955. 58, that's close enough. 58. Disneyland was 55, 58, correct. Correct, correct. All right, we got uh, Abel giving you a read here. Yeah. You want me yeah, to sure. move it over? Are you good? Sure. Uh, last time I said I was good, I almost hit it. Which way do you want me to move it over? Left, right? Left. 
Like one or one? Leg? One's cool. Yeah, one's cool. Thank you. Batman or Superman? Superman. Superman. You know Batman. My Batman story. <laughs> <laughs> um, favorite TV show growing up? Or favorite TV show now? Favorite TV show of all time? Oh! oh I, didn't, Brady, I didn't even get dude. to read. What to do? Left to right? That was pretty straight. Great, huh? Yeah. That's right, Abel. Wow. Looking like a wow. Uh, TV show. That's a good one. Um, man, I can't think of a TV show right now. TV show. Uh, TV show, TV show, TV show. The Sports Center. Oh, you know what? Pat McAfee. I watch it every day. Oh! oh. <laughs> That's it. That was it. It bounced right out. COVID rules. COVID rules. B and B started during COVID, so. Where do you put? Uh, Pat McAfee show. Shout out Pat McAfee. Uh, if, I make this put, if I make this put, Pat, you got to put me on the show. Yep. You got to put this clip on the show, Pat. Favorite restaurant in LA. Voice. LA boys. Favorite restaurant in LA. Elefante. Ooh, that's a good one. Um, favorite body part to work out. Uh, chest. If you could be any animal, what would you choose? That's short. That's way short. Any, any what? Animal. Oh, is that not even Any animal? It's got to be like a, an apex yeah, like predator or like a bird because I want to fly. Just the birds? Birds? Ooh, you know what? Maybe like scare me. Maybe something in the water because I like to swim. I feel like I belong in the ocean. Scuba Steve. Scuba Steve, you know what I'm saying? For par. Oh, par brothers. Par brothers are back. Well, you took a trip with me. To answer that last question, I'm going to say a shark. I'm going to say a shark. That's a good one. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for playing. Shout out to Taylor Maid. I'm a Taylor Maid guy as well. Um, you know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe. Give us a follow. Give your boy a follow. Give Fairway a follow. And hey. until the next time. Peace.